Well, most of us run on fumes instead of energy when it comes to our daily routine. Uh, it's kind of like we found it the norm to add some sugar and caffeine just because we need to stay on top of things. So you have to teach us about, well, a different type of lifestyle and hopefully a supplement or two. Andrea, it's good to have you here again. I must say, uh, being busy and being energized has become the norm. It's almost what we expect from people from day-to-day -day lifestyles. Definitely. I mean, the pace of um, the, the lifestyle definitely of these days is, is just so hurried always and it's like there's always so much to do and it's so exciting but to keep your energy levels up is a challenge especially you know getting up early in the morning and sustaining your energy all day so I think um, the instinct for many people is to grab for some sugar and caffeine which definitely is a quick fix for energy but it doesn't always sustain the energy Definitief nie, en ek kan het sê met meeste van ons wat opstaan en vroeg opstaan en seker allemaal wat saam met ons vroeg opstaan, hoe kan ons concentratie verbeter, hoe kan ek my geheer verskerp? Jong, die geheer verskerp is nogal, nogal een belangrike ding, kom ek achter as ek nou um, begin ouwe raak en soan, <laughs> want mys begin goed vergeet en ja. dit is belangrijk om te besef, jy moet genoeg slaap, um, jy moet gezond eet en daar is sekere voedingstoppe wat baie belangrijk is vir jou brein om skerp te bly. En dit is nou maar die B-vitamine wat mys kry in een gezonde dieet. Uh, mys kry het definitief in vruchte en groente. Um, so dit is baie belangrijk, hulle sê ons 5 vers vruchte en groente een dag. Dit is baie koos. Dit is baie, <laughs> ja. Maar sien, um, dit is waar vruchte sap of um, smoothies inkom. Waar jy miskien iets soos um, yoghurt en pineapple en limoen, wat is nou lekker tropische drankie hier so het. So dit is definitief een beter optie as een energiedrankie. Wat kan jy voorstel? So is there a supplement that supports energy and also mental alertness? How do we become okay without adding all the sugars and all the caffeine and all the other stuff? That's not good for us. Well, um, sometimes you need that extra boost. You know, so a healthy diet and enough sleep can only take you that far. But if you can't sleep enough, um, there are lots of energy tonics. Now, as I said, the problem is because they contain caffeine and sugar, they give you that energy spike, but they drop you afterwards. Right. So uh, Vital came up with a formula that addresses those needs, that if you have to stay awake long hours and you have to concentrate, maybe, maybe study during the night and that sort of thing, um, or have a very long working day. Or wake up very early. Wake up very early, <laughs> hey. <laughs> You're getting used to it. I am. <laughs> so um, it's called Vital Vita Charge Multi Boost Syrup. I call this my gummy berry juice. Right. So it really gives you that kick, but it also helps sustain your energy. And if you look at what's inside this, it, it's a syrup basically. I'm going to get you to taste it. It's oh, I get to taste the syrup. Pineapple, uh, pineapple flavor. But what's inside there is everything that's good for you. So there's vitamins in there. And there's no sugar. Ooh, now you have to be careful, okay. yes. It tastes delicious. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like pineapple. Yes, you It see. tastes like pineapple juice. And I'm sure you can taste the faint um, taste of vitamins in there. I don't know if you can taste I, that. I've never had a vitamin other than okay. the, the vital vitamin C. So oh, right. I, yeah, I, I don't know what a vitamin should taste like. But it tastes, to me, it tastes like pineapple. So you see, it's, it's a really um, good tasting energy tonic. One can also mix it into your fruit juice or into a smoothie. Okay. Um, and it contains herbal extracts and notably green tea extract. Can oh, you taste wow. the green tea in yes, there? Yes, I can. So the green tea specifically um, helps to sustain our energy levels. There's a tiny bit of caffeine in there, but not enough to give you that boost that will drop you again. So it, it's really about sustained energy. And obviously the nutrients in there also helps you to concentrate. So this is a healthy alternative. Listen, this is wonderful. So I could add this into a, a little smoothie. What else would you put in there in case you didn't like the taste of pineapple? Well, um, already you've got yogurt um, in that smoothie with fruit. Um, you'll definitely, you won't taste the, the syrup in there, but like you said, it's not bad at all. It's actually no. yummy. I must say sometimes if I crave something sweet, I'll take a spoonful of oh, that. Oh wow, See, yes. I, I like the idea that you can actually turn to healthy formulas and nutritional supplements, because it's not like a medicine, it's really, really no, good. No, but it works like a medicine, but it tastes good, you mm. know? Um, and it's safe for diabetics. Often if you taste sweet syrups, mm. we're very cautious, especially yeah. Um, individuals that suffer with um, blood sugar problems or if you have diabetes but this one is definitely safe it's a low GI component that sweets, uh, sweetens the product. Now most of the time they say anything that helps you sustain or that keeps your energy for longer or even alertness you should have really early in the morning otherwise you can't have it after two there's always you know long lists of directions as to how to do it when would you take this? Well that's a good question if you're going to have a very long day early in the morning is good However, if you're going to have a very long day and you still have to be up at night, um, for instance, studying, you can take this in the evening as well. But don't take it just before you go to bed, no. because then you won't sleep. <laughs> um, but sometimes you need something that can help stay, stay awake and study for those long hours. Okay. Yes. 
Well, this is really, it's, it's exciting to know that there's something out there that can help us. Give us the natural ones again, so enough sleep. Definitely enough sleep. Yeah. Um, drink lots of water. One of the first signs of dehydration is um, concentration and memory problems and fatigue. So often it's just by drinking enough water, so six to eight glasses of water. We're all guilty of that. Five <laughs> portions of fresh fruits and or veggies per day. And or we're going to share some recipes yeah. to, to how to get those raw veggies in. Um, and then if you need an energy boost, there's something healthy. Well, listen, it sounds good to me. We appreciate you being here and giving us some advice. It tastes really good. I think I'm going to keep this bottle next to me right here. Uh, we're going over to, uh, to Grant and you, and they're standing by. Be whoever you need to be with Vital.